Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my page, wherever you're watching this from. I'm going to start with the messages for ex signs. Okay, let's go into what your next six months in relationships look like. What relationships are starting for you? Which relationships do you need to work on? How can you show up behind these relationships? Which relationships are being your grandma attention for you over the next six months? And how can you show up better? We'll also take a brief look at what blessings are coming in for you at this time, okay? All right, so this is going to be for all my earth signs. Um, let's go into your reading. And then I'm trying out this new angles and it's making me feel like, ooh, yeah. All right, let's go into your message. What's the viral message from my earth signs? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. All right, baby. So you've got to believe in yourself. See yourself doing. Well. Oh, this sounds really so nice. You guys can't see the cards properly. Believe in yourself. See yourself doing well, and you will. And you've also got to thankful. Think about all the people you are and things you are grateful for. Okay. So over this next six months, it's going to be very essential for you to continue to believe in yourself. Never doubt how far you can go. Never doubt what you can achieve, never doubt what you're capable of, never doubt how far things, how, be, how, how good things can become. You're also being guided to be a lot more expressive in your, in how you share things, in how you show gratitude, especially like what I'm hearing is like, you don't have to have a reason to give things. Even the fact that you are alive, the fact that you have breath, the fact that you have sight, the fact that you can talk, you can smell, you can breathe, you can smell, you can walk around, even if you can't. The fact that you are alive, the fact that you still have breath in your lungs, it's more than enough to be grateful for. It's more than enough to be thankful for, okay? So over this next six months, however, events play out. I want you to really, really tap into that spirit of expressing gratitude. Also, I'm also hearing you have to be thankful to the people around you, people that have always showed up for you, people that have always been there with you, people that have always acknowledged you, helped you, um, people who have always made your presence you know, when you need them, when you, even if so, some of them, they may just be there quietly, and it's when you need them, you'll be like, okay, I can rely on this person. A lot of things you tend to overlook. Um, this next six months is going to show you, it's going to kind of like bring you more into the present moment, how to live moment by moment, how to live day by day, moment by moment, how to just stay grounded in the present moment. Because what I'm saying is like, yeah, the part of you that may be tempted to worry about, okay, how will things play out? There may be a part of you that I'm tempted to like, okay, how will things play out? But every time you remember like, okay, but in this present moment, you have everything you need. In this present moment, you have everything you need. It make it easier for you to transition into the next moment, into what you truly want. Now, over the six months, it's also going to be very essential for you to focus on really, really believing in yourself. As I said, you have to release a lot of limited thinking, negative beliefs, limited thought patterns. A lot of self doubts a lot of worries, anxieties, consternation, just all of those things to bed. Okay. See yourself doing well, and you will you guys will also be seeing a lot of rainbows. There's something about this six months going to this six months is going to fill you with hope, but the measure of hope is going to be um is, is this symmetrical to try? It's going to be like symmetrical to the faith you have in yourself that things are going well. So if you believe things are going well, things will continue to go well. But if you get into this self-deprecating um, mode and you keep spiraling, then things will not start going well because you actually don't believe they are going well. So your environment reflects your non-belief to you. But once you believe like things are going well, things just start happening. You guys are also going to be seeing a lot of rainbows. Um, birds are also going to be significant for you. Birds are also going to be significant for you. Earth signs, over the next six months, you guys may also feel yourself being pulled. So if you don't have pets, you may be feeling like getting pets of one type of the other, but there's this pull to animals. Okay, so I'm also going to use animal guides. Animal spirit cards when I'm doing your individual series, okay? 
but are going to be pulled to animals a lot so if you are because there's something i'm hearing like the animals are going to help you ground into the present moment so when all those worries and doubts start trying to spiral out and try start trying to make you spiral out yeah those animals around you are going to be like a comforting presence that bring you back into the present moment so that they ground you and they help you ground in gratitude okay all right make sure earth signs let's go into your personal individual signs readings um your relationships are also going to be like a huge source of if I go <laughs> before you go, um, your relationships are going to be a huge source of blessings for you over the next six months. A lot of this um, hope, a lot of this newness you are wanting is around how your relationships go. Okay, your relationships with your partner, you want something new, something different. Your relationship with your mostly, I mean, like your partner, but also in your work, you just want something different. You want a new level of intimacy you want a new level of partnership and all of those things are coming it's also requiring you to be very open to what it is you say you want instead of blocking yourself away and thinking that it's unattainable or unachievable be open to what it is you say you want okay all right my love i'll be starting off with taurus of virgo there seems to be a pull between those four we'll see ciao and if you've never subscribed to my channel or if you're seeing this video you don't follow my page what are you waiting for and if you like to be personal already with me the link is on my bio it's botanica.com <laughs>